important uh, announcement that we need to make we are having the upcoming beginners course scheduled for the month of march so as you can see in this uh, on the screen right now this is the bgnr 8 that you're talking about and what is so fascinating about this number 8 is that it comes in the year 2024 which adds up to 8 This is the eighth batch of uh, the BGNR course in English, and uh, if my memory serves me right, uh, Guruji Shri E K Dilip Kumar has uh, been teaching uh, professional astrology from the year 1995. So from 1995 to 2023, he's been in this domain of teaching astrology, the divine science, and uh, I personally feel that every person. Whoever is capable of simple calculations or uh, logical thinking should take part in at least learning the basics of astrology, thereby enhancing this field. And uh, who better to take the class than from our uh, uh, beloved Guruji, who takes uh, each and every principle or each and every uh, rule that's there in the rule book and gives a a humane understanding to each and every rule where to apply it why to apply it and why the rule is important see there are two types of coaches i always believe and i always say this there are two types of coaches one is a coach who teaches by books just by books he will give you a book he will tell you to read this read that and that's it the course is over but uh, from what i personally uh, uh, experienced from uh, the classes when i was a beginner student myself and at that time uh, when uh, guruji gave me uh, the sessions and i was like hungry for more and more i understand this is this is a common recurrent theme of all the students of guruji that they keep asking and hankering for more and more okay but to maintain the balance and to satisfy the the hunger and the passion in everyone because not everybody will have the same level of uh, passion or hunger to learn this so the pace has been kept at weekly one session number of the details are there in the website so as i was saying when guruji takes the classes for especially from a perspective of a pure beginner who's not aware of uh, astrology or anything connected with astrology even remotely connected with astrology he makes he first and foremost foremost he creates an atmosphere of comfort he says it's not something that you need to be uh, scared of it's a science it's a divine science but the only difference is that it is a divine science today's science is materialistic it's connected with matter astrology is a science which is connected beyond matter it is in no way connected or it is in fact it is connected with matter but it goes beyond that it finds the relationship between the material world and the world beyond the dimension beyond so when he explains the concepts he gives this interplay between the grahas and the events that happen in human life if not for becoming a professional astrologer at least it gives you a fair idea of the purpose of your birth the reason why you are born and uh, not just you but even the people around you why they behave in a certain way why do experiences happen at a particular time and what are the factors that uh, either alleviate it or you know to in, in instill or install the, those events in our life so these are the points that he takes he he leads by he leads the the finger he catches hold of your finger and takes you into that journey of exploring uh, the first baby steps of exploring astrology and this is an important uh, milestone the first few steps of learning astrology is an important milestone because if you don't get it right and if you don't even know that you're not getting it right and if you are on the journey without being aware at one point fine point of time you will find that nothing seems to work for you all right and that is when you will be in an abyss and you'll be wondering you know like uh, people uh, about to sink and they're going to uh, jump the boat and then you would say okay astrology is not for me or probably astrology is a myth so it is highly important and highly imperative that we take it from an experienced coach as i told you there are two types of coaches one who teaches by the books and the other who teaches by experience 
he has gone through the books mind you he has not avoided the books he has gone through the books he has mastered them and he knows what a tattva gyani like like rishi parashar is talking about rishi parashar has just pointed the finger the guru has to take you in that path in the direction in which the finger is pointing and this can be done only by experienced coaches so even for example i uh, see everybody can participate in a discussion and this is uh, um, not limited to astrology alone but when it comes into the purview of technical concept then only an adept can be a teacher you may be aware of the technicalities of how to work things out but then uh, to to learn the accuracy of the techniques and to go beyond and find out why the techniques are there are mentioned that requires a supreme dedication of another uh, level it's not uh, i don't think it's possible by mere mortal i mean it it is possible it will take a long time so to cut the the time frame you know to shrink the time frame from where you go about doing self study in astrology and to learn it from someone who has been there and done that and who has you know uh, as they say in english they walk the talk and uh, talk the walk so, so this is the way that you save time of course uh, nothing comes free and uh, when a quality uh, education is being imparted obviously it has to be given the proper dakshina for it so those who are really and truly interested in taking part in this bjnr or even this journey of astrology i strongly recommend enrolling in this course i will be there along with guruji and gautam and other seniors so we are going to assist and make sure that each and every batch gets bigger and better and gets uh, the proper nourishment that is need- needed and at a certain point in time when enough uh, students are joining irrespective of the time frame the classes will start so don't miss out don't uh, relax don't wait don't keep thinking when astrology comes you know you don't choose astrology astrology chooses you so when there is a knock coming in the back of your mind and uh, the knock is coming you know they want to enter your mind open the door without a hesitation and trust me you will not feel any regret whether it was the bjnr or the intr or the bspa whichever course i took there was only an apprehension for 5 minutes and after 5 minutes once the decision was taken it was all bliss it was almost ethereal every session was a thrill at the end of the session at the end of the course we had tears in our eyes and then we had uh, to beg guruji to start the next course right away and that is what happening in every uh, bjnr session that i've seen after that and this been happening you know when when there's a bonding between the guru and the, the shishya that bonding is something that you can only taste you cannot uh, explain in words so that is the taste that i've had so far so i would like to credit uh, uh, guruji for uh, imparting this uh, uh, divine science in a way that uh, has made a commoner or a layman like me to speak in the midst of you all and to give uh, uh, a presentation that is going to be really interesting after watching this video i'm pretty sure the inner urge to learn more about yourself the divine science the purpose of life the purpose of your existence would have become a burning uh, question that would be consuming you and you would be looking for directions where to study or whom to approach for uh, answers to these uh, uh, pivotal questions of life and uh, trust me the best place to start would be to take uh, the guidance of a guru there are many gurus out there and uh, the one that i connected with and with whom i have a very deep bonding and rapport uh, is the one that i can recommend of course um, this astrological science the science of divine science of astrology is uh, is not just confined to one uh, individual experience it is uh, it is um, an amalgamation of many such uh, resources and one among them is our uh, guruji who, who uh, conducts regular workshops and sessions for beginners and intermediate level astrologers and then he goes on to take uh, sessions and conduct uh, a lot of um, 
Zoom sessions, I would say, for those who have crossed that stage also. So for those beginners who would like to get their feet wet with the Vedic astrology and uh, to, to get a solid, ba solid uh, background, foundational background, uh, to start, to kickstart the journey into Vedic astrology, I would uh, recommend you wholeheartedly to join this course, uh, which is starting on in the month of March. In fact, it is March as we speak already. And uh, this course is, course is uh, a, during, a course that uh, spans almost 16 sessions, uh, not counting the additional sessions that uh, the senior astrologers would be conducting to, uh, to help clear your doubts. So that would be uh, additional and that would be as and when necessary. But the basic core curriculum of this Vedic uh, course uh, starts at 16 sessions and each session will have a two hour uh, um, time span which usually overshoots and that that uh, that two hour session consists, consists of uh, uh, I would say 75% uh, of it would be theory and uh, the remaining 25% of the two hour uh, time span would consist of uh, question and answer sessions where students questions will be answered by our Guruji in person and all these sessions are in person and uh, live recording will be available to all the students those who have participated in the session and those who were not able to participate they would all get the live recording of these sessions the reason why i'm talking about uh, taking this step is, is seriously is because the entire world is witnessing a change a paradigm shift in the way we approach or we are approaching all of us are approaching this materialistic universe and we, we are now uh, seeing a change happening uh, either for good or for bad we do not know but there is a change an inner calling that i've seen uh, many people uh, even youngsters, uh, even in the early uh, 20s, uh, they get this calling to learn astrology or to learn something about spiritual spirituality. And and what is astrology? Astrology is nothing but the technical side of spirituality. In fact, uh, uh, it complements spirituality. It enhances the spiritual uh, urge, and it also acts as a supplement to your spiritual quest. Because uh, once you understand how astrology works, then uh, you also get into uh, that wow mode and that awe mode, you know, A-W-E, awe. You get awestruck with how nature has its own way of um, um, making things fall in a particular pattern and uh, everything is connected with your past life's karma. Of course, uh, even the current uh, lifespan and your uh, the activities that you do in this current birth is also going to be uh, a big uh, influence in your uh, experience uh, in this planetary zone. So if you are curious and if, if if like me, if you want to know what could be the cause and what could be the, the reasoning behind uh, your existence, your purpose of life, the, the best way to start is to take this plunge to start this course, which uh, I'm talking about right now. And I think uh, it would be a good idea to um, enroll as soon as possible and um, to kickstart your journey into Vedic astrology. I will be meeting you there. Uh, I will be presenting the sessions as and when possible. And I think uh, the, the, the screen that you see right now is that of the website where you can uh, uh, browse, you can connect with Guruji and you can also click on the course uh, details and uh, click on submission and join the course. It's a pretty easy uh, step. You just need to click on this view here and, uh, and click on register now. As you can see, it, it just asks a very basic question. And um, once you click on, once you make a payment, you are enrolled as a student. That's it. And from there, the rest of the things happen automatically. So I would like to see you um, join uh, the course and experience the same amount of joy and pleasure that I experienced. Um, with this session, I'm, 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 I'm sure that it's going to be a life-changing um, experience. As uh, I've seen happening in multiple sessions and multiple batches after my batch. And when I was a beginner, um, I experienced some things. And later on in the next uh, succeeding batches, I could sense the participants also undergoing a transformative phase in their lives. And uh, they had uh, become more responsible and uh, more tuned to the cosmos. That is what I would say. But what is uh, good about, what is special about our Guruji's course is that he takes... Uh, the sessions uh, on a personal basis, on a personalized basis, and on an, uh, uh, I would say, uh, 
uh, feeling the pulse of the students and also answering the questions. Uh, there are certain times when he goes um, into a deep trance or a deep meditative state and then he gives uh, uh, answers to questions which are seemingly difficult for us to understand. So with that uh, sort of an experience coming up, you know, it's like, um, I would say the subconscious uh, knowledge that he has embedded inside his uh, mind, inside his soul, that speaks to you when, uh, when you get that uh, the opportunity to sit with him and have a session. So please do take advantage of it and uh, try to make your uh, journey into astrology as poignant as mine is, was and will be. So with all the wealth of knowledge that Guruji has to share, I'm pretty sure you will be taking the right plunge at the right time. So don't miss the bus. Okay, folks. See you soon.